Okay, welcome back to our final part of the Final Station Beta Let's Play. Right, we're just picking up exactly where we left off. Uh, da, 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 da. Have I been? Oh, I haven't actually been to this bit before, have I? That's right. Okay, can I go over? The oh shit, okay. Uh, right. Punch. Oh, missed him. Shit. Uh, punch. Come on. There we go. Right, now I'm on this side of things. That's still locked. Uh, a key hasn't spontaneously appeared in my inventory, obviously. Oh, this is so huge. Oh, no, it's an exploder. Um, that could get difficult. That d that's, This one looks easy. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'll take it back. I might have to take these on. Um, this time. Oh, fucking fast one. Bang. Oh, that took out most of them. <laughs> that's rather convenient. Um, okay, let's talk to him. Can't talk to him. He's dead. Uh, Jazz? Oh, hello. <laughs> A nice little Easter egg. Cool. Uh, right. Oh, that's locked. Fuck's sake. So much for the jazz room. I, think was, I don't think I actually managed to pick up anything here. There's no freebies, no ammo, no nothing. What a crap room. Apart from the jazz bit, that's cool. <laughs> Right. Okay, so this guy, there's a guy in here who's really theoretically straightforward, although I mucked it up last time. Uh, search him. Delicious ammo. Some cash. And um, just the, um, go up to the books room now. Hopefully there's not going to be too many baddies in here. Oh, <laughs> my wish is my command. Oh, hello. Um, good. Oh, God. A fact or fiction. For what low-abiding citizens' taxes are spent in truth? By Irvin and Amiga Publishing House. The good people at... Um, cash. And we are free. Free! Past the jazz room. All that just to get around that bloody door. Uh, okay. So going back on our... Oh! Dicks! It's one of you! And you've... There. Yeah, gotcha. Right. Reload. Anyone else for any more? Oh, it's the trash. Don't want to go down there, obviously. <laughs> Make sure I don't fall to my doom. What is those things? I said grammatically. Uh, oh, hello. Welcome to Vacation Hotel. Peace and comfort. Oh, I feel welcomed already. Guests of the Vacation Hotel are provided with three meals and health-improving services. Procedures start at eight. Dinner is served at nine. Bring your cutlery. It is forbidden to leave the hotel without prior... Oh, God. What a, what a brilliant hotel. What's up there? Oh! The inner workings of the hotel. How are the sausages made? I knew something is wrong with that house. No one believed me. Past week, they came from Matthew Below. And yesterday they came for the upstairs guy. I heard they came for him. I'm the next one, no doubt. I need to find a way to cut off current. Uh, okay. Let's turn off the lecky. Uh, welcome to Vacation Hotel, Peace and Comfort. Blah, 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 blah. Basically the same as before. Um, what's down here? I'm getting a little scared. There's nothing here. Oh, here we go. What's this? Oh, no. I thought, damn it, it's not the bloody... Um, I thought that might be the code. The sample is processed, demobilised, placed in general storage. To clean the room, change bed clothes. New checking in, three days. Most enlightening. <laughs> I'm sure you'll agree. Uh, do I need to go up? I do, yes. I, I think I might just be able to punch those um, things out. It would be a bit unfair if you didn't have any ammo, wouldn't it? Right, let's go down here. Check in this. Oh, it's an exploder. Ooh, that got me a little. Hmm. Ouch. Not too bad, though. Fuck. Oh, that's emptied out everything. Oh, uh, thankfully, when the game takes away, the game then gives with the other hand, which is a very mangled old expression. Uh, okay, punch. Shoot. Now just repeatedly punch this guy. Yep, 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 yep. And reload everything. A little bit of extra shell action there, which is rather convenient. Keep on going. Why has the hotel got ladders in it? Stupid hotel. Oh, hello. Friend? Stay where you are. Are you from the train? That's what my hat says. Uh, well, I'm sorry you're from the train. We have two, three. We need to take them. Uh, I'm sure I sh I'm, I'm supposed to be having some dialogue, but never mind. No, I have some ammo. Just worry about yourself. That wasn't what I was trying to do. I was trying to annoy you. A train? Okay, I'm waiting for you there. Good lord. Okay, I'll try. Yes. Um, I don't think my dialogue's actually been written in the game yet. Uh, okay. Right, okay, so I've got two people. 
I still haven't got an access code, though. I'm hoping... Med oh, medkit. Oh, oh, access code. Excellent. To David Rowland, head of New Cosfield Station. Confirmation of blockers code 7544. Phew. Oh. And I've got a key. And I've got out of the door. And it's the McDonald's sign again. This level seems to have gone forever. <laughs> it's actually quite tough as well. That approaches the difficulty level of Deadbolt. And the game this you know, reasonably represents. Oh, look, there's a matey boy. Hello. Move. Faster. We have no time. I oh, can't get any further. Alright. Let's... 7544. And roll aboard the chain. The train. <laughs> can't even speak anymore. Do, 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 do. It's the return of the train song. It's a little different to before. Do, 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 do. Two of ten, three of ten. Uh, looks like um, some people are okay, others are not. She's fairly hungry. He's very hungry, so let's distribute him some food. I wonder if you can actually keep them alive, because earlier on I lost, I lost two guys. But I couldn't see any actual way of um, doing anything about it. He's, he's bleeding out. I better give him some health. That's a horrible rumbling sound. Oh no, I've died and gone to heaven. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, let's get rid of that. Get rid of that. There's some, some piano music playing now. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. <sighs> So this is what was in that cargo. So, what what are you talking about? Uh, did I miss some? Did I miss some vital plot? <laughs> god damn it! Oh god, there's a oh hello. Love the, I do love the backgrounds in this game. It's really cool. It's almost a sort of like a Studio Ghibli feel about some of this. Just occasionally. <laughs> what is this? Said the hippie. The hippie's actually been with us from the start, hasn't he? It's the main plant, Nebel Hertz. Um, so that'll be that in the background. Um, he's still bleeding, and no idea how to secure his his blood loss. Well, he's a freelancer. <laughs> freelancer in what? And oh, she's a waitress. She was working as a waitress in a cocktail bar. A cocktail bar. Anything else going on? Yep. Okay, just a bit of ventilation to be done. That everything is fine here. I think I missed what she said. Oh, fuck. He fell to bits. Yeah, so he bled out. Um, she's hungry. Yeah, I better give her some scram. And the last bit of food. So make the most of it, love. There we go. Those These creatures could scarcely launch it. Very funny. And I've arrived! Bellu 07 arrives at another smoky old shithole. Hmm. Right. Off we get. And, oh, this is the final station. This actually is the final station, by the looks of it. Um, passengers survived three. Uh, all right. So, slightly falling off the top there. But Condor Miles survived, unemployed, $64. Um, what does that mean? Does that mean I get that? Um, John Cocker, shop assistant, dead. Um, Bob Nelson, retiree, dead. Um, Martin Jarvis, writer slash librarian. Oh, good. The hippie survived. Uh, hope he's going to give me lots of cash. Um, so, okay, so, by the looks of it, um, the, oh, the waitress, the waitress gave me lots of cash. Um, shout out to Charlie. Um, and profit, $414. So finally we see what the money's for. It's my profit. Good. Right. And that would appear to be Act 1 of the final station. Um, I, I think. <laughs> um, yeah, oh, these, these are my guys, aren't they? I know, you've already figured out where it goes. Take a family and save yourself, man. Um, shout out to the motorway that's in the front, <laughs> the foreground. You have an order. Uh, uh, it seems nobody here is aware of what's going on. Uh, good point. Thanks again. Short but sweet, I think. Uh, and oh, there's, there's a guy just rocking out. All right. Peace out. Oh, peace off, more like. I can't believe there's no... Oh, it's the Fonz! No, it's not the Fonz. <laughs> Sorry, I have some work to do. Look, I've just had a big, fat adventure involving zombies, and now you're all acting as if nothing important's happened. Are you going from the north? Is everything okay there? Well, 
you really don't want to know. Or clothing or whiskey. Everyone's got whiskey in this game, I like this. Isn't this a lovely day? Adam Thornton wants to meet you, it's urgent, he said. So this is... We owe it all to him. Alright. You can keep it too. His office is located at the peak of the factory. It's seen from anywhere in the city, you can't go wrong. The driver will be waiting for you. I'll print a blank with the code by the time you get back. Okay, so there's a bit more... There's actually a level here. I thought that might, might have been the end. Uh, thankfully that road isn't as busy as the one in the foreground. Oh my god, there's all sorts of stuff here. Um, now I can actually spend some cash. I'll buy a newspaper. Um, uh, <laughs> I'm not reading all this. Ah, whatever. Most interesting. Price for new prices for newspapers grow by day by day. Information about the outer world will be a luxury soon. Um, beard. Mark my words. He is from the plants. Right, let's see what's beyond. <laughs> Some bloke having a cig out the window. And a busker. This is strange. This is an interesting development in the game. Um, what's that? Oh, I can... Oh! This is a proper city to explore. Oh, how cool is this? It's weird not having a gun as well. We aren't open yet. If you need a room, go upstairs. So, what, what do we need a room for? We have two vacant rooms. The first is to the right, but it needs cleaning. Some Mooney lived there. An adjacent lodging outside, but there's a leak there. You may look around. Yeah. Today I met the old man. Clearly he's off his head. But the things he told me about the first contact are too important. I'll go north in the morning. I want to see it for myself. Uh, okay. There's a creepy cat guy just hanging out. Hello, mate. Hello! Where to go? What for? He knows nothing. No, I can't go that way. <laughs> Otherwise I might fall into a pipe or something. Can't shoot anything out, can I? No. It's disconcerting when there's no cursor anymore. When there's no gun, there's no... Well, oh, hang on. Hang on. Missed something. Oh, this is the other lodging, isn't it? Coins and... Oh, another spoon! I now have two spoons. Good. Oh, this is... A, oh, I didn't even notice this. Can I get that? No, I can't. Uh, right. Okay, so that's the hotel. Not quite sure what that's for. Let's let's keep going. Let's see what's over to the right here. Hello, mate. <laughs> Give me the thumbs up, I think. Uh, can I go down there? No, I can't. Another one visitor. Uh, well, she can count. Up here. Oh, ooh, hello. <laughs> Are you also to my grandpa? He is in, but please be quick, and don't ask about settlers. His family suffered much that time. Hey, Grandpa! Yes, I caught up to it, the first visits. I often asked to tell about it, but I noticed that hardly anyone really listens to it. I suppose so many years later, nobody needs the true story. Ah, you bloody wise old prick. Right. No idea where I'm going. I think I'm going to a factory. Well, but currently I appear to be in someone's basement. Oh, the, it's the offy! Oh, I can't even melee the balls off the wall. What do you want? Um, can you shut the door before we discovered? He he. No. Right, I'm gonna keep on going. What are they doing? I think they might be. They might be drugging. Oh, here's a phone. Yes. Um, I'm not sure who I'm phoning here. Oh, it's engaged. Well, that was a waste of time. Let's try again. Unfortunately, no. There is nobody. No, nothing I can do there. Oh, got run over. No, I didn't. Everything's fine. Uh, okay, so... Huh. Do I go back to the original guy, then? Back at the original station? Uh, might as well give it a go. There we go. Oh, so the... Oh, I've just come back here. Um, and there appears to be... Oh! Let's... Yeah, let's, um, let's buy a few of them. Exit. And some ammo. Um, buy... Yes, that's lots of this. A shitload of cash. I need lots of ammo for the um, the lack of adventures ahead. Uh, and what's this? This is a bar. Oh, I can get some is it food. I think so. I'd rather have some booze. Although I've got whiskey for days, of course. Thanks, but I'm not interested. Annoy someone else. <laughs> Very party hard. Hello, mate. Hello, mate. Please get into the car. He, he a willow. All right. Ooh, hello, Blondie. 
Um, good afternoon. Are you for meeting? I certainly are. Let me see. Well, yes, Mr. Thornton is waiting for you with a delicious plate of chocolates. Come in. Oh. Oh, it's, it looks like a drill and a hexagon. Hmm. Important work you're doing here, lads. <laughs> oh, he's got a big office. Quite high up in the air as well. Hello, mate. I know. Electron particles from mines do not transmit on radio waves. That's why people don't even know what's going on. This fog protects them from the external world. Moreover, they still avoid these places. But it's never you mind. Warn them if you want, but they won't believe you anyway. Let's get down to business. Time is running out. According to the contract with council, in case of the second visit, I have to visit the, the I have to give the factory's energy core to, cha to charge the guardian with it. Council should have provided transport, but I think you understand that your train is only running th is the only running thing. I give the order to attack the attach the cargo with energy core to your train, so it's better to hurry up. I, I know there's no way to jump over blockers, but it is your problem. See you soon. Uh, well, bye then. <laughs> See you, mate. Ah, there we go. Right, okay, so that's some unexpected um, end to Act 1. A proper actual town um, with stores and things. Yeah. Okay, so that's some so that's some act 1. Um the the rest of the game is still to come when it comes out of beta in full release in the summer. And um, it's all looking rather interesting so far, as I've been saying throughout this entire thing. A bit deadboltish, but with extra little bits here and there. Um, I kind of like the I'd like the train simulation bit to be a bit more involved. I'd like to see that developed a, bit, a little bit more, because at the moment um, it does start to feel like busy work after a while. Uh, but I would be interested to see how to actually to save more of those survivors, whether it's possible to pick up more medkits early on and make sure that they um, half of them don't all die. Um, anyway, yep, cool. So th um, thanks for watching this um, Let's Play of the Final Station Beta. Um, subscribe for more videos like this, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.